Every time I think I'm the fucked up one in this group, Kiki, you open your mouth. And then I'm like, no, I'm doing great. Thank you so much for reading my fic. I really appreciate it. I only really plan for this to be like six chapters, maybe seven. It's not gonna be super long at all, but I hope everyone's really excited for what's to come. And you know, kudos and likes are always really appreciated. They keep me really motivated. Six to seven chapters, huh? Happens to the best of us. I'm only human after all. I'm only human after all. when your university's student service website starts with an A. So now, for the first time in seven years, Archive of Her Own isn't the first Google autofill that comes up on your phone. Ooh, a swan, that's nice, I like swans. Oh shit! And you don't seem to understand. I think I'll do a wrap around. We'll wrap around. You know, my favorite type of weed was uh cocaine. Gotta know exactly who you are. Lord, have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. We must. What kind of a maniac wakes up an hour early to write erotic fan fiction? Me. I want a goddamn cheeseburger and some goddamn fries, you fucking boobass! I got a Glock in my ass! After me. Okay. Crispy, juicy, tender. I just put my newborn son into a blender. Just then, the king felt true fear for the first time. Let it straight, take control of your mind and meditate. Let your soul gravitate to the love, y'all, y'all. Okay. I was like racking my brain on how someone like this can even exist. And then I found out she's from Manitoba. You guys see that? It's called being awesome. So if I'm honest, I think I'm beginning to question how much I want this. Catch me if you can, Mr. Holmes. imagination run out of control. Well, that's easy for you to say. You have a bad imagination. It's stupid. I live in a fantasy world. Yo, I am not joking when I say I found a story on here with three million words. Bro. Bro. Dude. Dude. Okay, but... Bro! What the fuck? How how the hell are you going to go on a platform and write eight, this is 8,000 pages? How do you write that much? How do I read that much? God, AO3 writers, you're, you're fucking insane, dude. What the fuck? What you looking for? We got what you looking for. What you looking for? We got what you looking for. Post it, enjoy this, but still stand in God's light. That was too good. Let's get the bell. Per. You know what they say? If there's a will. 
There's a way. <gasps> oh, shoot. This is getting interesting. In reality, I'm actually very fun, relaxed, and easy. Just then, the king felt true fear for the first time. These were not the words. <laughs> Why would you write this? <laughs> Why would you write this? Um. Oh. What's up? Hi. Um. We all have a good angst fic. We all like, you know, unrequited love, miscommunication. Maybe they broke up and got back together. And I was reading a fic that was like the latter thing. And it like ended fine. They got back together. But tell me why I'm just finding out for the first time. Like. An author could sit down and look at the two characters that you love and you're reading the fic about and make one character say to the other, I don't love you anymore. That's allowed. Um, it had a happy ending, but honestly, I still need a minute. I'm still reeling. Like, I'm hurt. It hit me deep in here. Oh my god. I don't... I don't know exactly. What happened earlier today, I started a new fic, and then I had to leave and run errands. And when I came back, I was like, yeah, let me read a couple more chapters. And, and I don't know how long ago that was. I know the sun was still out, but then it's like I, I blacked out, and now it's 3.20 a.m. And I think I've been reading for the better part of 10 hours, and I'm on chapter 36 out of 50. And it's a 243,000 word fanfic, and I'm gonna finish it in one sitting. That's my toxic trait. As I have no memory of this place. Up to no good. For real. Behind every hot girl is a fan fiction that she wrote when she was 14 that will never see the light. Mine was Angel Ross and Grantaire, and I called the Lame Miserable book the brick, and I, I this is a do you ever get so lost in the sauce while reading an AU fanfiction about a side pairing that you forget that those characters actually come from an original piece of media? So you're like reading the fic, you're so invested in, you know, maybe they're royals, maybe they're assassins, maybe they're in space, maybe they're bounty hunters, and then you go, Kageyama Topio? <laughs> what are you doing here? And then you remember, <laughs> then you remember that you're actually just reading a piece of fan fiction about some side characters from a way bigger piece of media that has nothing to do with space, cowboys, bounty hunters, assassins, royalty, or any of that stuff. <laughs> yes, Robert, what do you want now? More money, a check, a car, my soul? <laughs> Airstrikes. Bomb them. Bomb them. Keep bombing them. Bomb them again and. <laughs> 